share this channel on the internet. How are you doing guys and yep we're back for those people that emailed us and wrote to us direct messages wondering if something had happened to us no we're all okay it's just we decided to take a week off from posting because the kids were on spring break and we wanted to spend time with them and enjoy ourselves but we're back and today is going to be another solo ride with me and her and the dog so we're going out exploring and by the way things are looking i think it's going to be a picture day because we haven't launched off and she's already taking some but it's okay though it's okay and remember if you want to keep up with us on the daily posts follow us on instagram and if this is your first time visiting our channel make sure to subscribe and turn on notifications because if you like family boating fun we got more coming saw the Fort Lauderdale Beach spring break little video that me and Fresco did now we're gonna check out the west side because the spring break happening here too even though the hurricane kind of messed up a lot of people's plans here on the west coast because every uh, you know a lot of things are not you know repaired but some things are, are working so we're gonna cruise by the beach and check it out and the day is windy today uh, actually very windy so usually when it's windy here, it's choppy out there. So we'll see what happens, man. We'll see what happens. And while I'm driving, she's modeling. Look at that. She's taking selfies. Selfies. to expect the red tides here windy hurricane damage so I don't know how how spring break is gonna be here but I guess we'll find out today and a few people has asked me the same question that I asked myself so many neighbors with so many boats but yet nobody takes them out like in my canal there's about 10 boats and I've seen only two come out out of the two years that I've been living here. But not us. We're always on the water. Well, at least we try to be. And yep, definitely I think today is picture day because she's taking more pictures. Right there, he's right there. And yep, she loves taking pictures. At least I'm not the one taking them this time. And plus, even if she asked me, how can I say no to that? And yep, just like I expected, the bay is a little choppy. Okay, so I posted this video a few days ago on Instagram and a lot of people were confused and wondering what was going on. A lot of people figured it out, but a few were a little bit lost. What happened is I was fixing my glasses and my hat came off because of the speed plus the wind. But for those that were wondering, the hat was saved and recovered by Ovita.
and we just went through Punta Raza Bridge. And you can't really tell on the camera, but it is very lumpy. It's just the camera has very good stabilization. So I really didn't know what to expect once we pulled up to Fort Myers Beach, but we're gonna take our chance and go there anyway, because we are out on the hunt for the Spring Breakers and see how the West Coast does it. And we are riding by the beginning of Fort Myers Beach and by the look of things it looks pretty empty but we're gonna go by the pier well what it used to be the pier and as you can tell it's very hard to keep the camera stable on this lumpy water And as we get closer to the pier, well, what it used to be the fishing pier, there's more people hanging out here. And also, Margaritaville is coming along pretty fast. And we can see more people on the beach, but they're starting to look like locals, not spring breakers. Well, at least the good thing is people are still enjoying the beach here at Fort Myers. And I'm starting to feel like the beach report got. And definitely the closer we got to the sand, the choppier it got. So it made it even harder to keep the camera still. So sorry about the shakiness, guys. And I'm really curious about something because the beach is still kind of messed up because of the hurricane and yet there's still a lot of people here. So I'm wondering once everything goes back to working conditions, how full cool this area is going to be. And after being here for a while, honestly, I was surprised there was still a lot of people here because I didn't know what to expect. I thought it would be kind of empty, but to my surprise, there was little groups of people all over the beach. And I say maybe a few spring breakers, but the rest seem to be locals and family members visiting. So, well, we conclude that there was not as much spring breakers as for Lado Beach. And if you guys haven't seen that video, I'm gonna leave a link on this video description below and you guys can check it out and see how many spring breakers there were at for Lado Beach. All right guys, so we made it over to Fort Myers Beach, but the day is a little cool, it's windy. There's a few people here. I think we're just gonna hang out for a little bit and maybe pick an island and go have some lunch because it's really windy and choppy here getting annoying to be on the boat so uh, we might just hang out for a little bit here and uh, sightsee and then get over to an island baby. Yeah, it's a little lumpy. 
So I guess the nearest island. Let's go. And this is a good thing for me. Once I'm in the water, I really have no time schedule. So we just gonna go with the flow, wherever the show takes us. And definitely we're gonna look for a spot where there's less wind and calmer water. And I think we just found the perfect place. We went to Sanibel Island. Now last time we were here, we were on the golf side, but this time we're on the bay side. And look how much calmer the water is. And with almost zero wind. And I guess this other boat is here, having the same idea as us, running away from the wind and the waves. So we're gonna back her in and throw anchor. And we finally made it ashore in calm waters. And I think we hit the jackpot because there's a lot of shells on the beach. And like usual, we come to the beach on the boat, but she doesn't want to get wet. So how do you figure that? Well, Yuli and Ogita are finally happy that we hit solid ground because the whole ride and while we we're hanging on Fort Myers was wavy and bumpy. And from a spring breaker search, it has turned to an island exploration here at Sanibel Lighthouse. Because last time we were here, there was heavy equipment and we couldn't see the lighthouse. But now today we are and also the island exploration turned to a photo shoot. Because like I say, if you can't beat them, join them and finally, we had our lunch. Good, but you know what time is it? What time is it? But all that and more is coming up on our next video, so stay tuned for more.